Summer is upon us. We've had a good first few months of the year. We've accomplished much and look forward to the halfway point of the year. We are never perfect. There is more work to be done. It's progress, not perfection. Our goal is to improve and enjoy our time. Our willingness to do what is necessary, even when uncomfortable, helps speed up the process. First, we'll start with a serenity prayer. Today's reading from the 24 Hours a Day book, a share. Then the reading again in case you got distracted. Carpe the diem. Enjoy. God, grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, courage to change the things I can, and the wisdom to know the difference. Grant me patience with the struggles that take time, and appreciation for all that I have, tolerance of those with different struggles, and the strength to get up and try again, one day at a time. Consider, are we ready for our new life? Willing to give up our old false sense of security? June 15th, thought for the day. In Alcoholics Anonymous, we have three things, fellowship, faith, and service. Fellowship is wonderful, but its wonder lasts just so long. Then some gossip, disillusionment, and boredom may come in. Worry and fear come back at times, and we find that fellowship is not the whole story. Then we need faith. When we're alone with nobody to pat us on the back, we must turn to God for help. Can I say, thy will be done, and mean it? Meditation for the day. There is beauty in a God-guided life. There is wonder in the feeling of being led by God. Try to realize God's bounty and goodness more and more. God is planning for you. Wonderful are His ways. They are beyond your knowledge. But God's leading will enter your consciousness more and more and bring you ever more peace and joy. Your life is being planned and blessed by God. Your life is being planned and blessed by God. You may count all material things as losses if they prevent your winning your way to the consciousness of God's guidance. Prayer for the day. I pray that I may earn the rewards of God's power and peace. I pray that I may develop the feeling of being led by God. Fellowship in Alcoholics Anonymous is a means to an end. Aside from fellowship and sociability, the prime object was to provide a time and place where new people might bring their problems. Meeting makers make meetings. It does not mean that they stay sober without actually working the steps. We fellowship and attend meetings to meet the people who have what we want, and we ask them to guide us. We are willing to do the suggestions. If we sit in meetings and don't get on the field of life, we are still running our lives on willpower, without drinking, but the drink will come soon enough. God is the answer. He is kind and loving. He's not a rough taskmaster. We work the first three steps and we find faith. Enough faith to turn our lives over to it, however we define it. We get on our knees with our sponsor and we recite the third step prayer, and we mean it. God, I offer myself to thee, to build with me and to do with me as thou wilt. Relieve me of the bondage of self, that I may better do thy will. Take away my difficulties, that victory over them may bear witness to those I would help of thy power, thy love, and thy way of life. May I do thy will always. After we try it for a while, it is easier to do, and we believe it is the easier, softer way. We are running on God power, no longer using self-will run riot to get what we don't even want. Our God consciousness opens up a new portal for us where we discover new pathways to enlightenment. The old societal, materialistic, esoteric desires appear empty and vacuous to us now. The simple, loving interactions, helping others in and out of the program are our new pleasures. Each day is a new adventure, blessing us with childlike enthusiasm for the unknown. Wonders abound around us in the formerly mundane landscape of our lives. We love letting him drive the bus into our new life. Consider, are we ready for our new life? Willing to give up our old false sense of security? June 15th, thought for the day.
In Alcoholics Anonymous, we have three things, fellowship, faith, and service. Fellowship is wonderful, but its wonder lasts just so long. Then some gossip, disillusionment, and boredom may come in. Worry and fear come back at times, and we find that fellowship is not the whole story. Then we need faith. When we're alone with nobody to pat us on the back, we must turn to God for help. Can I say, thy will be done, and mean it? Meditation for the day. There is beauty in a God-guided life. There is wonder in the feeling of being led by God. Try to realize God's bounty and goodness more and more. God is planning for you. Wonderful are His ways. They are beyond your knowledge. But God's leading will enter your consciousness more and more and bring you ever more peace and joy. Your life is being planned and blessed by God. Your life is being planned and blessed by God. You may count all material things as losses if they prevent your winning your way to the consciousness of God's guidance. Prayer for the day. I pray that I may earn the rewards of God's power and peace. I pray that I may develop the feeling of being led by God. Please subscribe for more videos. Thank you for watching.